providence is God's way of staying anonymous. If he doesn't want to be out front and be spectacular God, he will work behind the scenes providentially so that it looks like what I call in the sermon a coincidence. You will never get to see God's providence at work in your circumstances until and unless God sees you move in accordance with his will. He has to see you believe him, not hear you talk about believing him. Faith is measured by footsteps, by your feet, by your walk, not your talk, by your life, not your lips, by your movement, not your mouth. God is the God of intersections. He connects things that don't look connectable when it's that night. When the timing is hit just right and everything is looking wrong. One of the main ways God answers prayer is through what you would call coincidences. He has overt ways of answering it, but he has covert ways of answering it. Coincidence. I just happened to run into this person. I just happened to be at the right place at the right time. It, it just feels like luck, looks like luck, sounds like luck, seems like luck when it's providence. You keep your luck. I choose providence every time. You don't know who you dealing with. Because God knows the right time to turn a situation around. I'm trying to tell you, you don't know who you're dealing with. 